In this video, we will be studying about the foreign exchange market. The foreign exchange market refers to the market for national currencies of different countries in the world. See, where your different currencies will be US dollar and then pound and then yen, Australian dollar, dinar. See, all these currencies are traded where there is demand and supply of this national currencies of different countries in the world is your foreign exchange market. It is the center of trade for different currencies. Buyers and sellers in the foreign exchange market wish to buy foreign exchange or sell foreign exchange. So, it refers to the market for national currencies of different countries in the world. So where your currencies are exchanged for each other is your foreign exchange market. What are the functions of the foreign exchange market? The first function is the transfer function. See. It implies transfer of purchasing power in terms of foreign exchange across different countries of the world. If you are going to USA, you want to exchange your Indian rupees to USA. So what this foreign exchange market will do? It will transfer your rupee into US dollars and it will create a purchasing power for the dollars. Second is your credit function. It implies provision of credit in terms of foreign exchange for the export and import of goods and services across different countries of the world. Let's suppose you do not you want to import something from Japan but you do not have currency of Japan with you. Now what you will do you will borrow the currency from the foreign exchange markets and will buy the particular machine and do the imports. So this borrowing is handled by the IMFs or the foreign exchange markets. So you can take the credit. So this is the credit function. Third is the hedging function. It implies protection against the risk related to the variations in the foreign exchange rate. Demand for and supply of foreign exchange rate is committed to some commonly agreed rate of exchange even when the commitments are to be honored on some future dates. Now what this market does, it provides you the hedging function. Hedging means reducing the risk. Suppose you have imported a machinery of two hundred dollars and when you place an order your one US dollar was forty rupees right but at the time of payment after one month when your machinery was delivered to India so your one at that time, there was fluctuations in demand and supply, so one dollar became fifty rupees. So now you'll be paying the extra ten rupees. So you you are in a position of loss. So now, so what foreign exchange market does? It provides you the hedging function. The buyer and the seller comes into a contract that is a future or the forward contract and they decide on one agreed 
foreign rate that is it was 40 so they they decided 41.50 so whatever be the rate in the market of the foreign exchange but a buyer has to pay only at the rate of this so your foreign exchange market provides you the hedging function I hope you have completely understood the foreign exchange market and its function. Do download our Scholars Learning app and enjoy the learning experience with us.